Mr. Chairman, this is the, uh, the product of uh, about two months' worth of work for the, uh, the Subcommittee on Business and Consumer Affairs uh, as we looked at a total of about 69 different uh, business entities um, and, and the different uh, implications as far as licensure requirement. Why were they licensed? Was it to impede competition? Was it to protect the public? Uh, as the deliberation went through on that committee, we pared it down to roughly 29, and uh, this PCS has pared it down even further. Um, the PCS provides financial relief for nearly 106,000 professionals or businesses at a co total cost savings to the private sector of almost 13 million annually. Um, I know there's been a lot of questions of who and, and what's on the bill, what is not on the bill, what has been taken off of this PCS is condominiums, cooperatives, timeshares, mobile home parks, professional geologists, home inspectors, home associations, landscape architects, mold-related services, surveyors and mappers, employee leasing companies, and community association managers. Um, in essence, we have been trying to be, uh, we have tried to work as transparent as possible and have taken a lot of uh, emails and testimony and this is a product that I think will help uh, Floridians get back to work and that is the bill Mr. Chairman. 